Napoleon. And I'm Hannah Jorman. And I am Mary Ebbett. Today is Tuesday, March 21st, 2023. Our thought for today comes from Ariana Huffington. We need to accept that we won't always make the right decisions, that we'll screw up royally sometimes, understanding that failure is not the opposite of, of success. It's part of success. Making the wrong choice sometimes is part of life. Accepting that you're not perfect and that mistakes happen is the first step towards bouncing back from the failure more easily. You'll come to view your mistakes as just another step on your way to success. Yesterday was the first day of spring. Our weather will be a little below average for part of this week, but by Thursday, the temperature will be back around 80. Enjoy the weather and let's keep pushing forward to the warmer weather. Happy birthday to Kaden Rapperson in sixth grade today. If you see him, make sure you say happy birthday. Tomorrow, the dog and fall, grades will be taking out ELA jacket in the morning. Please be mindful of this walking silence as you travel through the harbor on Wednesday morning. For lunch today, we will have a choice of nachos with cheese or popcorn chicken with roll, green beans, seasoned carrots, strawberry cup, and a fresh pear. The snack today in the fresh fruit and vegetable program is watermelon radish. The word of the day is eliminate. E-L-I-M-I-N-A-T-E. The word eliminate has nine letters and four syllables. Eliminate is a verb and its definition is completely remove or get rid of something. Some synonyms we connect to eliminate are remove, abolish, and banish. To use eliminate in a sentence we hear, her plan will completely eliminate sugar from her diet. The company plans to eliminate a thousand jobs in the coming year. Look for the word eliminate in your reading this week and see if you are able to find ways to use it in your conversations with, with others. Words become friends only if we include them in our daily activities. Make friends with new words every day. The baseball team and softball team will be playing in their first game this week on Thursday. The team will play a ranked game against Mad. Our next game will also be a great game on Monday against Belgrade. The first home game will be on Wednesday, March 29th. The third quarter grading period will be ending next week. Now is the time to check your power school for missing assignments and ensure that all of your work is handed in. The book fair is coming. Mark your calendars for next week. March 27th through 30, the 31st, you will have select times to shop for those special books. Yeah, please hand for a moment of silence. For May's hand, and we are led in the recital of the Basilisian by the second grade of Miss Elbert. Let's read this to the flag of the United States of America. Today a great day and don't forget